there are some expectant mothers who have questions about getting a COVID-19 vaccine. Certainly a concern, but the main concern is, is it safe? KTAB's Mercedes Hernandez has more from a Hendrick OBGYN who clears up some of those questions. Dr. Whitney Mascaro with Hendrick Health says there's no need for expecting moms to worry about getting a COVID vaccine. But to the medical community, honestly, this vaccine is really nothing short of a medical miracle. She says because COVID vaccines are mRNA vaccines, they are safe. That's because they do not contain any virus particles. She says it's like getting a shot to prevent pertussis or the flu. The only vaccines that we don't give pregnant women are live attenuated viruses. But other than that, we have been giving pregnant women vaccines for decades. Dr. Mascaro also debunked a myth about vaccines and fertility. There have been some um, unfounded concerns about the COVID-19 vaccine and infertility. There are no clinical reasons to support any of those concerns. Though findings are limited, an ongoing study following 2,000 out of 30,000 moms-to-be that did receive the vaccine is yielding positive results so far. There have been no signals to suggest that there's any increased risk to the mother or the developing fetus or the neonate greater than in the background population of those that are not vaccinated. Dr. Mascaro recommends getting the vaccine because doing so protects mother and baby. She adds that breastfeeding after getting the vaccine could also pass along antibodies crucial for keeping a baby healthy. And the best ways to prevent a newborn from getting COVID-19 is for the mom to not get it and give it to the baby. And furthermore, for the babies to have the antibodies to prevent themselves. In Abilene, with coverage you can count on, Mercedes Hernandez, KTAB News. Thank you, Mercedes. The American College of Obstetricians and Gynecologists recommends that COVID-19 vaccines be available for pregnant and nursing women. The CDC also saying no reports of miscarriages, stillbirths, or preterm births have been linked to the vaccines in women who were pregnant.